Hi there Trailer Park fans, it's Jolene Sugarbaker, the Trailer Park Queen, and welcome to the Trailer Park Rumpus Room. It's been a while since we've been in here, it took me a while to clean it up, I'm sort of a hoarder. And, you know, I love to collect kitchen gadgets and, you know, food products. I like to try those out. And, do y'all like to collect kitchen gadgets? I've got a ton of them. And, you know, I just picked up a few new ones and I'd like to share them with you. And it's kind of like a haul. And, um, let's see. The first one here is, it's a baggy rack. And this says, holds open storage bags while you pour. And I thought this was neat. It just kind of suctions to your counter and you can put the zip top baggie there and maybe you could freeze them later on. But I thought that was kind of handy. I needed that. I don't know why, but it could just stick somewhere in the kitchen and I just, that is a baggy rack. I got that at the kitchen supply store. That is really great. And um, oh, these are really great. These are the my favorite things to carry the cut citrus with. It's kind of like a pick and also like a little, it's not even a cutter. It's just kind of like a hook. It looks like a crochet hook and it just slices open an orange real simple and they're mostly kid safe. I mean, I didn't hurt myself growing up with these, but you know, there's all these crazy laws now and saying save the children with you know all these different laws there's probably a law against you know orange peelers i don't know but i survived but these are really great and i found those um at some kitchen supply store i don't know but i just really like those and let's see here and i've been seeing on all the sites that people are making pasta out of zucchini and i know that that comes out of the garden you know, late in the season and people are trying to get rid of it, so why not make some pasta out of it? Not that that's at the top of my list because, you know, vegetables, not really up there, but I found the Vegetti. I think I said that right, and um, I just like how this one looks, and you just kind of stick the zucchini in there and twirl it around, and it makes spirals, and I just really, I, you know, it's an as on see uh, as seen on TV product and you know I just you know had to have it you know how we are in the trailer park with that yet and let's see here um I'm always stopping up the sink and um I get these they last a long time but sometimes I get a little aggressive with them uh, but the turbo steak they've been around for a while they were as seen on TV sometimes they're in the markdown store surprisingly but these work. Um, I don't like pouring all those chemicals down um, the sink, and um, I don't know why, but um, they say that there's three-eyed fish in the river next door, and that's not something I want to contribute to. And But this just sticks on down in there and swirls around, and close your eyes, and it pulls up everything with that. But that's Turbo Snake. That, I love those things. But I do go through them just being a little too aggressive with that. And let's see what else I have here. Oh, I, I bought a bacon tray because I broke my other one. They don't really make them industrial like they used to back in the 80s, but they do get by. It's just, I think bacon is the best in the microwave, so I got that. And then I went over to the food store and I found some new things and it's probably been around since the dawn of time, but banana sauce, and it says hot, and it's not the consistency of ketchup, it's more like hot sauce, and I can't wait to try it on something, maybe some chicken or something, but banana sauce, I don't know what that is, but we're going to try that, and then I found in the candy section, um, this is from, where is this from, product of Indonesia, um, tea candy, classic iced tea, naturally flavored tea candy, made with real tea extract, a natural source of antioxidants. Now, as I've gotten older, I just had a birthday, um, I'm reading about these antioxidants, so um, why not have them in a candy? And iced tea, it sold me right there, so I got those. And this stuff, I get it all the time. You know, I do eat some raw vegetables, not many, but uh, cucumbers. 
This says you can use it on watermelon and oranges and all sorts of things. I don't think so. Not me, but on cucumbers, I really like it. It's got dried chili peppers and things I don't know what's in it, but it's really good. It gives a kick to it. It's called Class Chili Powdered Seasoning. It's really good. I like it, and I find it usually in the exotic section of spices. But that's why I need to stop spending money. I don't know about you all, but I do spend a lot of money on kitchen gadgets and food. What do you spend on? Do you do that too? Food and kitchen gadgets? Leave a comment down at the bottom about what the latest kitchen gadget or latest food item you bought that's the latest craze. Down at the bottom. And um, I'll be back with some more cooking shows soon, so hit that big old subscribe button. Don't forget to follow the Trailer Park on Twitter. I'm Jolene's Trailer there. Add me on Facebook. I'm there too. And visit the all new Jolene's Trailer Park.com that I redid and it's fantastic. You should visit it. I love y'all and I'll see you back real soon. Bye bye.